Hey, a very good Thursday evening, everybody. Thanks for stopping by for your pinpoint forecast. Today we had cloud cover move back in, so we started very cold, and for most of us, we were only able to top off at about 40, some of us in the upper 30s. Tonight, though, that cloud cover will work in our favor. Yes, it will be cold. Yes, a freeze is headed our way. And sure, some frost will be possible in the morning, but compared to the teens and the low 20s, 29 to 32 across the Brazos Valley tomorrow morning, will be an improvement. Now we've got warmer and more humid air moving into the Brazos Valley. It's not going to sweep through for all of us through the day. So I think daytime highs in our northern counties are around the upper 40s to about 50. Everybody else low to mid 50s for tomorrow. Here's how we get there. Still cloudy through the day. Cold in the morning, chilly in the afternoon, light southeast winds 5 to 10, with a small chance for a few light showers to some patchy drizzle once we get into your evening plans. Saturday, we get a little warmer, upper 60s. Sunday is the same. Notice Sunday, though, out to the west, temperatures are colder. There is a cold front there that moves in Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening. It will up our rain and thunderstorm chance to a 60% potential. It's not going to be a huge washout of your weekend, but it could drop about half an inch of rain. Skies clear, sun is back behind that cold front. It's not necessarily going to be as big as the last one we had. It's more of the Pacific nature, so that means daytime highs are seasonable back in the low 60s as we start next week. Got more details over at kbtx.com. Latest details not on News 3 at 10. Until then, enjoy your evening, and we, as always, will catch you back here very soon.